it's me Aisha and today I'm gonna be showing you guys what I thrifted so I spent quite the pretty penny on some thrifting stuff um, because I only go thrifting like twice a year um, like really big thrifting twice a year um, and that's when summer rolls around and when winter rolls around when summer comes up I don't know where any of my clothes are when winter comes up I don't know where any of my winter clothes are so every time like summer or winter comes up I have to go thrifting so it's starting to get really hot here and I'm like I don't have any clothes um, so I decided to go thrifting so um, I'm just gonna jump right into it so the first thing that I see here is this like vest and this vest is it's just a gray vest i think it's so cute i've been wanting a vest and um i wanted a like a black one but then i saw gray and i was like this is so nice i love the color gray i mean i'm wearing all gray today but um yeah and it has pockets so yeah that's that and i bought this for um how much did i buy this for I bought this for $18, so yeah. I was almost not gonna buy it because I don't really like the buttons on it, if you could see. I don't really like the buttons, like I wish there was no buttons here, so I wasn't gonna buy it, but then I was like, I actually do need a vest, so that's why I got this one. All right, next, what's the next thing? The next thing that I got are these um, shorts. They're huge. They're men's shorts, but I'm going to try them on. Um, and they are authentic Wrangler. So as you guys can see, it's really baggy. So what I would do is just like flip it over. Like one. Like that. I do this to a lot of my pants because I wear a lot of men's wear. So, um, yeah. Oh my God, I have a food stain on my shirt right here. That's so ghetto. But um, yeah, so I would just fold it like this and I'm still able to walk, to turn around, like they're not gonna fall off. So that's like a little trick that I do. A lot of the, the waist, like they don't fit my waist. So I always just flip it over because I don't like wearing belts. Um, so if you're also like me, you don't like wearing belts, then flipping it over is also really good too. So yeah, I think these are really cute and I love the pockets. This is like an everyday short. I'll wear short shorts, but like, I don't know i prefer this because i'm more comfortable and it's like i can feel a breeze you know because it gets really 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 disgustingly hot here next thing that i got okay let me finish this bag first so i got this shirt now i was very skeptical on buying this shirt but i decided to lean more towards buy it i had like a tank top on when i went thrifting because i just like to put like easier clothes to change out of um, and when I put this on, I wasn't feeling it, but the little strap of the the um, tank top that I had on was really cute. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna do this. And then I, I decided that I wanted to like cut the side of this and like have it kind of like hang off of the shoulder like this. But um, just to have the shirt like this is not really my style. Um, so this is the shirt and this shirt is actually from Paris. Like the tag has it on there. I don't know if you guys can see. And I just felt connected because I was just in Paris this like, this christmas it is giving paris vibes it's giving vintage vibes the car i love like old school cars so this is how the shirt looks and my vision is to cut it and then have it off of it let me just do it but i'm probably gonna do it horribly because i'm trying to do it on camera but i'm gonna show you guys what i thought i wanted to do or what i think i'm gonna do with this shirt because honestly one thing about me is like it's very easy for me to go thrifting because like I know exactly what I like and what I don't like and that's why I can go so fast and I also can just envision how I would like to wear an, um, a, an item from a thrift store you know and so envisioning it and doing all of that in like less than like a second so yeah it's honestly a talent okay I don't know how I'm gonna do this okay I'm just gonna cut along the seam hold on why am I doing this? This is so bad to do it like this. First of all, this is not even my dominant hand. But I want it to lean this way because of the car. My dominant hand is this, but I can't. I don't know if I can. Okay. Okay. 
now i have to oh shoot sorry i'm trying to look in my mirror over here okay see that is too tight just a little bit i mean that could be something but it's kind of choking me right here but i don't want to cut it right there so sorry i'm literally just talking to myself um I mean, technically, I am talking to myself with the camera, but just a little bit. All right, like that. Then have it like this. Now, I don't know if I want it. I don't know if I want it to droop because this is like the other shirt that I'm wearing, my gray shirt that I'm wearing for the video. Like, it's just drooping more down. But for this, I was envisioning it barely drooping down just giving a little shoulder not too much like midway and then i would wear like some nice pants and it's kind of like a slanted asymmetrical thing so that that was my vision for this shirt when i saw it because i don't really wear like bright colors that much um but i can always envision and i can always see when something is actually nice so yeah this is for sure cute and i can't wait so the next item is this blue shirt that i'm gonna wear as a dress and i got one in white too so i'm gonna show you guys this first i don't really wear dresses like that but this is a tank top and i feel like it's cute because when i put it on i was gonna buy it as a tank top but it's kind of long enough to be a dress but it's still short and it's like cute you know so you're gonna see <laughs> it's a little baggy up here but it is short but it's not showing anything it's not showing anything i'll just have to like pull it down every second but i think it's really cute if i like pin it back because right here it's big i can like pin it back and make it more like sleek you know okay so the next item is let me actually just pull out the white one and show you guys that where is that oh it's right here it's right here thank god okay two other tank tops that are potentially 100 percently would wear as a dress so i'm gonna put the white one on i think that i like the white one better oh almost fell um i like the white one better because it's longer for one i feel like the blue one stopped like right here so it's gonna be a lot of like pulling down which is probably gonna be very annoying to wear out um it's long i could even wear this like now to school with like this this blue and yellow puffer jacket that i wear all the time like this with some sneakers see that boom right there a fit and then next i'm gonna try on this tank top i'm not sure if this tank top was supposed to be a dress because it kind of looks short so maybe i got it to wear it as a shirt but we shall see we shall see let me try it on so this is the next one and so yeah i think it is i did get it to get it as a dress um this one is really cute i think um i like this way but this blue better than the um other blue because i like darker colors but i also like this one and the white one are my favorite um the other blue i feel like i might just crop it to like a really really short um shirt and then just wear it as that um but yeah so i was really happy when i found these because they're so cute like i don't know i did not think i was gonna wear any dresses this summer because it's really hard for me to actually like a dress like um i don't know it's really hard for me to be like i like that dress but i also could like wear like a really tight dress too it just has to be the right type but these are just like i just love these they're they're cute they're flexible they're sporty this is giving me like cookout outfit like i'm going to a cookout um everybody's gonna be there it's gonna be really hot like throw out my air force ones with this perfect i'm trying to like give you guys some game right now i am um all right what's the next thing so the next thing are these shorts they're gray and they're really baggy these are also men's shorts these i was almost not gonna get them Oh my god, there's so much traffic. 
Okay, I was almost not gonna buy these. Oh my goodness. You guys don't move to New York City, please. I don't know why I bought these because I forgot. I don't think I really like them. But maybe I might like them if I turn them in. Oh my gosh. If I like turn them. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about these. I don't think I really like these as much as I thought. I did try them on and I was skeptical about it. But then I was also like, I love the challenge, right? But now I'm kind of like, it's just not even cute to even try, you know? But maybe the material is also just like really bad. Yeah, I don't know why I got this. Maybe I might sell it. I don't know. This summer I want to work on my Depop and selling stuff. So maybe I might sell it. Um, next I got this tank top. I got a lot of tank tops because that's me. Like I feel like if you were to define me in like an outfit, like an, an Aisha outfit, it would be a tank top, like a wife beater. Sorry, I don't like saying that, but um that you can get like three in a pack for ten dollars on the street. And then um some Levi vintage Levi's or any Levi's but men's very baggy. They're falling off of my waist, but I'm still trying to wear it with no belt. And some Jordan 4s or Jordan yeah, Jordan 4s. That's my outfit right there. That's my basic outfit. That is my signature statement with a nice like a either a big jacket that's like a leather like brown extra 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 large jacket or something i don't why am i like explaining this to you guys but it's just so you guys can really understand like my type of style you know because it could be very confusing very anyways next outfit or next item i'm not gonna wear this because it's literally just a tank top and it's nude and i have a lot of brown um pants and I was thinking that nude brown with like a dark a dark brown will look cute with my um brown shoes. So yeah. Next I got these shorts. I really like these. They're just brown basketball shorts. Brown is my favorite color for those who don't know because my skin is brown. Um, it's just a beautiful color. Okay guys, so I have the shorts on. I like them and I'm actually going to be playing basketball this um this summer um and practicing i'm planning on joining my um i'm not going to tell you guys what sport it is it's not basketball but at school this summer i want to be very active i know i'm going to be very active i love shorts very breathable breathable that's number one number two they're brown so that sold me and number three i actually play basketball for fun so you know i think they're cute too i don't know who l is but hey l they're really cute and they're not that big so i could even fold them in if i wanted to and it has the reebok sign on the waistline but yeah next what's the next item okay so this item was giving me very much like 30 year old soccer mom that wants to like be fashionable because number one is from ann taylor which i just associate with being like a you know older millennial you know working in an office kind of store um and yeah so but i put it on and i said you know what um i've been applying to a lot of jobs if i have an interview and they're fashion related jobs if i have an interview i feel like this is something that's kind of cute and i'm also into like all different you know types of fashion i'm i'm everywhere you know what i mean like menswear is number one but i'm everywhere in every category and every you know checking out different brands that cater to different demographics like i'm there you know like i don't stick to one thing so even though it did give me that vibe that's completely different from the vibe that i give off i thought you know this could be cute and i could even like make a thrift like a a streetwear type of look with this shirt if i really try hard enough so I'm gonna put this on and I'll be back. Sorry, I have an explanation for every item. I don't know if that's probably annoying, but I'm a fashion student if you didn't know, so that's why I keep talking. <laughs> but okay, I'll be back. Okay, so I don't know if you guys can see what I meant by this, this shirt giving 30 year old, you know, or even 40 year old mother. Um, it's just giving that cross like this is something that they would do like i feel like they would wear this they love this like the scrunch up because 
you know it's giving fashion for them you know um but i kind of liked it and i'm like you know i could always just make it a little bit more party or i could make it conservative um wear it to a job interview to show because like i said they're fashion job interviews showing my necklaces that's a plus you know the scrunch is cute if i wear some low-waisted jeans you know what i have the perfect jeans that i would wear with this and because i love y'all even though i have zero subscribers um because i love giving out advice i'm gonna put on the jeans that i would wear with this outfit just to help you guys out so i would wear if I could find them. Maybe they're in the laundry bag. Yeah. They were in my laundry bag, but they are these low waisted jeans, and this is what I would wear. I'm gonna put it on and show you guys. Okay. These are the jeans that I would wear. Um, they're long enough. Sorry, something's in my eye. Ugh, something's in my eyeball. You see it? It's right there. Dang, my eyes are so huge. If you agree with me that this shirt is giving 30 year old mother, you know, then I feel like wearing low waisted um, jeans will show your stomach and showing your stomach shows youth. Even though you're wearing an older business like shirt, you can spice it up wear some low waisted jeans. Or if you wanna, if you want to, um, be more conservative put on some slacks some gray slacks you could just make it an all gray look um you know cover the goodies up boom right there but this is how i would wear it right here i'm gonna show y'all this is exactly how i would wear it though low waisted boom i can't even see the full outfit this is exactly how i would wear it you know this you don't know if I'm 30 or you don't know if I'm 18. You don't know if I'm 19. You don't know if I'm 20. I'm actually 20. But you don't know because this is giving 45 or 18. So, yes. Next outfit. What else did I get? Okay, I got this shirt. I actually don't like shirts like this, which is weird. So, I'm like, why did I buy it? But there was, there's always a reason. I just don't remember. <laughs> The reason why I say that this shirt I don't really like is because, first of all, what is going on? Is this the inside or outside of the shirt? Hold on. I'm so confused because the tag is like, I'm like, I don't know. Okay, anyways. So, like, I do not like shirts. First of all, this is from Zara, and I feel like Zara does this a lot. They make the shirts with, like, the what is it called like the the rectangle box and for me it just doesn't look good on my body so it probably looks great on other people's bodies for, for, but for mine it doesn't look that good um because like i think it's just the way that i have like necklaces going down it kind of just cuts that off it also just makes me look more boxy and i feel like my shoulders are already kind of boxy so you kind of when you're into fashion um or when it just comes natural to you i feel like you know exactly what would look good on your body like down to shapes and colors and things like that and so i'm a little baffled like why did i even buy this but i'm gonna put it on and maybe when i put it on i'll remember why i bought this because i really do not like the triangle boxy you see it i mean the um, rectangle box thing i don't like that but let's put it on maybe it's something spectacular that i forgot putting the shirt on i realized exactly why i bought it i bought it because it was it's low cut so i forgot to mention that if it's a low cut um rectangle like type shirt like this then i'm fine with it i'm very fine with it but if it stops right here because i know a lot of shirts that like stop like right here instead of this being down here it's like all the way up here basically and i feel like that just looks horrible on me so now i know why i bought it because i love this this is so cute i love this um and it's long too so because sometimes oh my god is there a stain on it oh my god there's a stain there's a stain on it okay i'll try to bleach it but um 
another thing that i really like about this shirt is that um it's long because a lot of the times like i don't want to show my stomach like some days i'm like i don't want to show my stomach but my shirts are all like cropped you know in some way or somehow even in the winter time like there's always i don't know what's happening but they're always cropped so it's like i like shirts where i don't have to show my stomach all the time i love showing my stomach though okay i'm just saying okay so i'm done with this bag so i went thrifting two days in a row so everything that i showed you guys um was from one day and then this is from the second day next item is this look how do you pronounce this again i don't even want to say it wrong it's a lacoste yeah lacoste um sweater and at first i did not like it no at first glance i did like it at second glance i liked it and then when i went to try it on i was kind of like i don't know if i like it because of the collar the collar is just a little what's the word i don't know i just didn't i didn't feel the collar because i feel like with collars like this they look weird in the back like let me show you like i feel like they look weird right here but maybe i'm wrong maybe i'm wrong but that's kind of how i feel i feel like it's like a hunchback it's giving me a hunch so i don't know but um overall i got it because i need a like a big sweater an everyday sweater that i can put on top of whatever i'm wearing now that it's getting hotter outside i still have to take the train to school every day um and i'm on the train late at night like early in the morning late at night um and so i just don't feel comfortable just like wearing this which i would love to because it's hot so it gets so hot here but i can't do that so i always need to have a sweater with me or like um a really big shirt because that's just the society we live in i don't feel safe nor comfortable wearing a tank top on the train so yeah but anyways yeah this is like really long too which i really like so i got this like really big shirt and this reminds me of um fishing i don't know that's just what it reminds me of i don't know i've never been fishing before but it just gives me like fisher you know fisher hat fisherman hat and like this you know i'm fishing <laughs> who fishes like this i don't know but um yeah i think it's really cute i like how so they go all the way down but i like them folded like this i don't know it's really baggy which i love because like i just said earlier like i like to cover my arms and stuff like that when i'm on the train um due to me not feeling comfortable with just wearing this so yeah i think it's really cute next next item is just this shirt um nothing special about it i don't know if i want to cut it or if i want to keep it like this um but there's nothing special about it so i'm not even going to try it on it's just a two-tone gray shirt and i wouldn't i feel like the way i would wear it is just like put it on and then like scrunch it up and tie it in the back next next thing is this shirt i go to like the men's dress shirts and i just try to look for patterns that i like and that i can wear every day because i'm a minimalist so i don't really shop that much um i only thrift like i told you guys two times a year like big thrifting and it's not really big like this is what i classify as big and this is what i'm gonna wear all summer so yeah um but yeah i always go into the men's section and see like go into their dress shirts and try to get some sorry i thought i heard somebody at my front door but yeah i thought this was really i think this is really cute um i love the pattern can you guys see okay let me stop being lazy and get up okay the pattern i don't know if you can see the pattern boom i think it's a really cute pattern it's very small like you can't even tell but it's like boxes and it's uh white and then black oh maybe i'm seeing it wrong but that's the weird part because i see black i see blue i see brown like okay i don't know maybe it's just me but i don't know what i see next item is this shirt and i have a shirt exactly like this so i was kind of like should i get this should i not but i ended up getting it anyways because it is a little different 
um the other one is like shorter and i wanted one that can actually cover my butt because i i don't know if it's just me but i wear jeans that are ripped in like the derriere area because okay it's so hard for me to find jeans that when i do find jeans i wear them a lot and um yeah and i I'm, like i said early like i'm a minimalist so i don't have that many jeans so i like wear the same things all the time and um one of my jeans in particular i'm not gonna tell you guys which one because that's crazy but one of my jeans in particular like they have a rip like where my butt is so because i wear a lot of baggy clothes and like i, I like a lot of these like over sized shirts i wear those all the time even though there's a hole in my butt in my pants where my butt is located so i don't know if i'm the only one that does that but like if i find a good pair of pants i'm not going to throw them out like they have a hole in them i need to continue wearing them no one's going to see them because i'm going to wear this shirt all day and it's covering the dairy air like i don't get it maybe that's just me being cheap but like i said i thrift all my clothes so it's not like i can just go to the store website and buy a new pair you know um but yeah this is the last item and it is another men's button down shirt so i hope you guys enjoyed the video um this was my summer thrift haul summer is it's down near here like i know we're still in april i think summer starts like june 21st i don't know if it's 21st still but like it's usually june 21st and it's it's already getting really hot out to the point where i'm like i have a tissue everywhere patting my forehead every second it's crazy hopefully you guys enjoyed and i'll see y'all in my next video bye